啦啦。And welcome back to My Sims. This is Blala, and today we're going to be checking out a couple of cute Sims, aren't we, Blala? Yes, we've decided because um, we already have quite a lot of pre built items for some of the uh, Sims and uh, the things that they enjoy. But one thing that we haven't built yet, we haven't built a really cute item um, to satisfy those cute sims that we move into town. And that's what we want to do today. We want to make a new cute item. And a few weeks ago, I asked for um, ideas of what we could build for cute sims down in the comments below. And Dylan um, came up with a wonderful idea of building a doll's house which I just think is fantastic. It'll be quite a big doll's house because um, he was very keen for us to use the Tim and Tina dolls to put in them, which again, I just think is such a lovely idea. So that's what we're going to do. Um, we're going to do that today. But first of all, we need to meet... Hello, Elmira. You're always here, aren't you? You like it here, don't you? I don't blame you. It's pretty studious. Pr pretty studious house. I mean, look at this. Look at this sofa. You know, I, it took me ages to build this sofa. I'm really pleased with it. Um, so anyway, what was I saying? <laughs> first of all, we need to meet our cute Sims for this episode. Let's go. Go find them. Who do we have today? <gasps> Pinky! There, there's one! Oh my god, look, she's so cute! Pinky, she's a cute star level 4 townie sim, aren't you? Hello, she got little, little wings! Hi, I'm Pinky. I love the colour blue. Don't you? You, blue. <laughs> that rhymed. Ah, <laughs> yeah! <laughs> okay, good, right. <laughs> um, oh well. I, I, her hair's fantastic as well. Look at her hair. Oh my god, I wish I could put a hairstyle off like that. Would you like to move into Blarmania, Pinky? Um, with your little wings. Look at the wings. Uh, sure, I'll move in as long as you make my house blue. I'm sure I can do that, Pinky. Let's go and make Pinky a blue house, blue house, blue house. And here it is, her blue house. Oh. <laughs> with a little, pe a little, a little, a little bit of pink, just, a, just a touch. Um, <laughs> because of course the cute houses, when you build them, by default they are all pink. Um, so I had to repaint this uh, just about this does things to my eyes. This is weird. Um, and uh, I clearly I forgot about this bit. No, <laughs> clearly I forgot about that. No matter. Uh, wow, it's very blue in here as well, isn't it? Oh look. She has some sort of blue bathtub. Look, there's going to be pink as a. Uh, Blueprint. It's it's a little bit weird. It's it's a little it's a little bit weird. I'm not gonna lie. Oh look, look. Oh my god. It's like a little very. Oh, oh. I love this. Oh, I love this. Pinky. I love the fan. Oh look. Oh look at the little pink flowers. Pinky. I like this place. Oh, this is nice. Hello. How are you? Do you like it? I do. <laughs> Turns out. <laughs> I seem to quite like it a lot. Look at that, she's got curtains, she's got curtains. What a great house. But is it really blue enough? <laughs> yes, God damn it. it I, I can, can possibly be any more, bless you, any more blue, could it? Let's um check out Pinky in our relationships book. P. Lemon P. <laughs> okay, Pinky's house. So cute being her main interest, followed by geeky. Is she into geeky? Or is it just because the geeky icon is blue? Who knows? And uh, she hates studios. So Pinky loves anything that's blue. Blue dress, blue eyes. She even has blue hair. Wait, why is her name Pinky? Yes, yeah, well, that's not exactly her choice, was it? That's her mother's fault. Her mother clearly liked Aww. pink, named her Pinky. <laughs> but she likes blue. Blue. That's fine. That's absolutely... Bless you. That's absolutely fine. Are you on a bed too? Well, you're not having one. You're going to have a doll's house. Yes. Let's go meet the other cute sim uh, for today's episode, which is going to be Jeremy. Let's go and find him. Hello. There he is. There he is. There he is. Jeremy. Jeremy. Oh. She just slapped him. Brandy just slapped him around the back of the head. Oh. oh my god, Brandy's such a bully! What in the hell? Oh my goodness. Bless you, Jeremy. Bless you. Oh my god, are you okay? Are you okay, Jeremy? That was so mean. I like the bunny. <laughs> I like the bunny. He's in like a onesie. Whoa, was I uh, sleeping? Was was I was I uh, sleeping? What am I reading? <laughs> my name's Jeremy. <sighs> 
He just sleeps all the time. He's like always in his PJs. Look, that's like Blala's outfit, except she has it in like a turquoise. But she has this. I mean, you peeps never see this, of course, about Blala. But at the back of Blala, like she's been designed 360 models the whole lot, and um, she has one of these like little access poop flaps. <laughs> She does, she does. It has yellow buttons on it. I swear, it's, I swear it's it does. Um, but yeah, so anyway, Jeremy. <laughs> talk about, yeah, Brandy. Get lost, innit? Right. Would you like to move into Blumenia? Get away from that Brandy bird. Um, okay, I'll move into this town as long as it has lots of beds. Can you make me a house with a big bed? I just want to go to... Uh... <laughs> yes. Uh, oh dear. Oh dear. That's that's unfortunate placement. It was like something started coming out of his bottom. Right, Okay. Let's go and make Jeremy a house, and I'm assuming that he's going to be giving us some sort of amazing bed blueprint. If he isn't, then something's awry here. Welcome, Jeremy, to your very pink pad. <laughs> Jeremy's crib. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, crib is in that baby crib because he's always sleeping like a big baby. Yes. Hello. Oh my god. Look at this. Look at this. Huh? Huh? It's a really big toy. It's as big as I am. This looks like a giant potty, not a table. I don't know. I don't know. It does sort of look like a big playhouse, doesn't it? But I think the doll's house will look really good in here. So, um, bath, mirror. Oh, look. Oh, my God. It is like a crib, just like a baby. Oh, my God. It's a cot. It's a cot with a mobile. Oh, Jeremy. Are you just the world's biggest baby? Are you? Are you? Wake up. You silly nincompoop. Get up. <laughs> oh my goodness. So, <laughs> there's his blueprint. Jeez. <laughs> Do you like your house? Do you like your bed? Is it all good? Take uh, time for a nap. Oh, for goodness sake. Right, well, I think we know Jeremy, he, uh, Jeremy's game. He is banging to the old sleeps. But um, let's just check him out in the relationships. But let's find out um, a little bit more about Jeremy, if we can. Here he is. So, Jeremy's crib. He's cute and tasty. Um, it's not into fun because this is Jeremy Snores. Okay, <laughs> his surname is even Snores. Um, right, okay, and that's it. So um, not into fun because he's always asleep. You know, he he hasn't got time for fun because he's he's too busy like catching up on his naps. What was that quote from Red Dwarf? If I don't nap nine or ten times a day, I don't have enough time. Uh, no, enough energy for my main snooze. That's it. Yes. Right. Okay. So. That's it. I mean, there's nothing to learn about Jeremy. He sleeps all the time. He wastes his life sleeping. I mean, that's that's legit what he does. Right, okay. So now that we have um, discovered both of our cute sims, it is time to go and try and figure out how I'm going to make a doll's house. But I, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. I have a, I have a pretty big doll's house in real life, actually, because I'm also a big baby. Um, <laughs> and uh, a sort of big Victorian doll's house. Actually, yeah, it was... Um, it was my grandma's. Uh, she had it for many, many, many years. Ever since I was very, very little. And I used to play with it all the time. And um, uh, she she gave it to me um, about a year or two ago now. Because um, she, she just didn't want with the upkeep. It takes a lot of cleaning, you know. A lot of cleaning and stuff. And, and I want to make things for it and stuff. So she gave it to me. So this, uh, th this should be fun. And I might make it look a, a little bit similar. This doll's house. Because... Um, my Victorian doll's house is pretty much just six big room, six big rooms. So I think I reckon we could do something similar to that. Maybe not six. How big does a room have to be in this? I don't know. Let's go and find out. So we have started with the um, sculpture blueprints. So we've just got. We just have to have something here. So that's fine. Now something else is that we need a Tina doll um, here and a Tim doll. So there's a, see they're now see they're huge, right? So it might be that. We can only really have sort of one room in this, this doll's house or something. Uh, I don't know because uh, these dolls are huge, um, which means that if they were going to have multiple rooms, um, do you know what I mean? They would just be like, it's just absolutely massive. Um, unless we make the furniture a lot smaller than the doll. I don't know. I don't know. Should we figure it out? So <laughs> um, first things first, it needs a floor our doll's house that much we do know um it's going to need some sort of a back shouldn't it have like a window in it or something i don't know um it needs sides now if we were going to have one room that's that big right that's that's quite a good sized room right good sized room um I'm making it a, a a fairly hefty 
um, size doll's house, right? So, um, let's see here. If we get rid of that. And we'll put that in. Right. Okay. Right. And then if we wanted... Because the idea is you're supposed to have, like, a door between rooms. Right? Now it's going to be a little bit taller, though, isn't it? It's going to be a little bit taller. It's going to be a little bit taller. I don't know. Oh, it's also confusing, peeps. It's, it's, it's actually really hard. I... I don't know. I don't know. Um, should we do a second floor? Should we do a second floor? We could do a second floor, couldn't we? Uh, what we need is... Um, I'm probably going all the way around the houses. What we need is um, one of these. So I think I shall investigate doing a second floor with the room... So it might be that we end up having four rooms. Let's uh, let's do uh, the, the initial design and see what we get. Okay, so here it is. This is our, our initial design. So we've got one large room down here, which I'm thinking can be like a, a kitchen, living room type space. And then up here we have a, a bedroom and a bathroom, something like that. And then we've got a doorway going between the two. Now, this, uh, this is our roof and these will be windows. So we'll put glass essence here so that we can see out the back. So where are we um, at the moment with this? So, um, 49 blocks because of course I think you're limited to is it 99 blocks to um, one of these craftables I think uh, they tend to be referred to so now using the remaining um, craftables that we have we need to uh, uh, make uh, the the interior try and do things on the inside so shall we start with say the kitchen so we could start with the kitchen and what we might do actually is put the kitchen this side because it might be nice if we can try and get a chimney here i don't know if it'll work but we could give it a go couldn't we um so what we'll do is we'll start crafting um sort of the items uh for for the kitchen uh what have we got going on here yeah, right so i'm thinking something like this for a kitchen countertop do you see do you see peeps or we might even be able to break those bits up um, so that we could make it look like we've got like a, an oven, you know, and a bit of kitchen countertop or something. We need like a fridge, don't we? Don't we need like a fridge? Fridge, fridge freezer, something like this. Fridge freezer. Uh, so it could be that we have, yeah, should we, should we do that? So if we move all this back, this could be our fridge freezer. <laughs> but just work with me, peeps. Work with me. <laughs> work with me here. Countertop. Uh, and an oven like that you see and then we could put um and and look this 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 could be maybe like a, a sink at the back here i don't know could that be a sink i don't know i think it might be asking too much so look that there could be our our kitchen countertop and then what 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 we would need is some sort of fireplace i i'm thinking some sort of fireplace here um might be nice so if we how how would we do one of those then peeps um so, something ooh, so, so a bit like this maybe something something like this oh oh but it might be a bit big um let's have a look because there's that piece um that they actually use in the fireplace um uh not that oh hang on that piece yeah no nah. We sort of use its flames and in the real fireplace but it, it is too big i think oh but look we could maybe we could do something look 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 so that's like little flames right <laughs> little flames and then on on this side uh on the outside here what we need is some sort of um a chimney breast going going upwards look 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 like like this right so it's a little bit off but that's fine I'm sure I'm sure we can cope with that. Oh, that might be a bit tall. And then if we have we could ooh, ooh, oh oh no oh no oh 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 my god shapes what would this be? Could we do something like uh I don't like that. I, I legit hate that peeps. <laughs> I was thinking it'd be nice if we could have it You see what I'm doing, don't you? You see you see don't you i know you do um but it's not working for us so we'll do this um i feel like it should be a little bit taller again even uh, oh what about like something like this and then um and then what about like little you get like the little oh my god just don't do that 
Oh my god, it's almost like it's a hand giving us like the flying Vs or something. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not sure. Um, once you see it. So here we are. I think that we've managed to furnish our little doll's house now. Um, so you can see here the, the living room kitchen that we were working on. I've added a bathroom. So we've got a bath, a sink and a toilet. Um, and then we've got a bed with some bedside tables and this is, I don't know, like a chest of drawers or something like that. So th this is it, yeah. Um, and it might be nice as well if like here we could get maybe some pictures, uh, like a picture on the wall. Um, we might be able to do that with just a, a square thing and um, getting sort of the right type of essence to paint on it. And, it, uh, and that alone might make it look like, oh, it, it, it dis disappears. <laughs> um, would be enough to make it look like some sort of some sort of picture. Oh, we could have something on the mantle, couldn't we? I don't know what though. Um, yeah, so we might see if we can make those into some sort of like picture or yeah, you know, we might be able to look. We might even be able to put like a larger picture up in the bathroom. A large picture. There we go. So the next step um, is to paint the doll's house um first of all um we we know what keeps it that keeps things simple um where are we going and what are we doing because this is fun this is cute here so we don't oh yeah look look we do have garnet so we can make the windows like a a see-through pink so i think the doll's house in itself should largely be pink right um these uh we've got quite a few um oh look we could use the happies that would make it a blue and yellow doll's house because we've got lots of those but look at this look at the plum blossoms and plum blossoms are really easy to replace as well look at the roses we've got so many roses so we could make the doll's house or maybe that would be good as the the chimney i don't know well i don't know um let's oh dear i've messed it up i've messed it up already so it would probably be nicer wouldn't it to have a, a lighter pink i'm thinking maybe for the doll's house and that affects um oh it doesn't affect that i was thinking that affects the carpet um yeah maybe maybe a lighter pink of some kind might might be nicer for the doll's house but this is like a purple isn't it this is a uh, very bright oh look so like the tina dolls uh produces quite a nice uh light pink you know that's quite a nice pink but we don't have many of them that's that's the downside is that we don't really have have many of uh the tina doll pieces um and they can be a little bit tricky to get um so i think i might have to go out and uh and get some more tina dolls maybe and um what else could we get i think we've probably got quite a nice selection here we need to try as i say make as many of these cute essences as possible all this needs to be sort of cute so we can really get the the cute off the off the scale you know at the moment look it's 55 percent, so we're doing really well at the moment um so yes we're, we're we are absolutely getting there um so i think we'll grab some tina dolls and then I reckon we can do the rest with what we have here. I do. I do indeed. Let's do that then. So, we are in the desert. Hello. Yeah, hello. Look, it's Wendelin, everybody. It's Wendelin. Say hello, Wendelin. Nabazudi. Nabazudi. Uh, for my birthday, my favourite mummy bought me my first voodoo doll. Ooh, she had a birthday. She had a birthday, peeps. And she likes voodoo dolls. And she messed up a spell. That's fine. That's fine too. Right, yes, so now we're in the desert. And in the desert is where you find your Tim and Tina dolls. In a cute cave. Yes. Um, so if we head um, on the map, if we head to... It's about here. And we've got our little indicator here. So if we follow this. Underneath we've got Goth Boy's house there. And then underneath Goth Boy's house we have a cave that we opened up I can't remember when but we did at some point and this is a cute cave and I believe in this cave we can find Tim dolls Tina dolls and some crayons it could be red and yellow I'm not sure let's find out let's familiarize ourselves once again with this cave um, of course when I go up to a new star level in this series we um, we investigate 
where to get all the essences in that star level. We open up the relevant star level areas. Uh, red crowns, there you go. Um, and all that sort of stuff. Um, if you would like me to make an episode um, when we've gone through all the my sims, if you'd like me to make an episode about, uh, you know, that is literally about all the essences and where to find them. So, and then, and then we can also, in the comment of, uh, not in the comment, in the description of that episode, we could make it so that um, I can list all the essences and their timestamps, or all the areas, or both, and and then everybody knows where they where they can get all these essences. We could even like show their patterns, you know, what what colours they they paint and patterns they make and stuff like that. I might do that. It's a very time consuming job to make a video like that and edit, but I might be willing to do that right at the end of the series. We'll see how I feel, and and it, and if of course you peeps want it, if you really aren't that bothered, then why should I put in all the effort? Ah, oh, Tina dolls, finally. But um, yeah, if you really really want that, then of course I'll do it. I'll do it if, if it's demanded and wanted and, and whatnot. Look, so this is it. We have found the right cave. This is indeed the cute cave. It's it's kind of cute looking, uh, to be fair, isn't it? And we are now finding the Tina dolls. They seem to be um, more common than the Tim dolls. We've not seen any Tim dolls yet, have we? Um, but there are definitely Tim dolls down here. I know there are. I promise you. We've seen yellow crayons, red crayons, the Tina doll. And I promise you the Tim doll is here too. I'm, I'm convinced of it. I'm... I don't really want to to walk away until until I've proved that there <laughs> that there are indeed Tim dolls in this cave. I swear, I swear, as peeps, that there is. There, Tim dolls! Ah, I knew they were. I knew they were. Right, let's head back and paint the dolls' house. And here we are. <gasps> the dolls' house is complete. Ooh, look. So, we have the bathroom here, and we have uh, Tim, he's, he's in the bath right now, yes he is. We have a cat who's uh, on the bed, because that's what cats do. Look, and we did manage to get a picture, we had to make it quite a large picture, but we managed to get a picture on the wall. Down here, the picture on the wall is just a happy face, and there's a dog in the kitchen, and Tina is in the living room relaxing. <gasps> oh, look, it's our doll's house. And you'll see here that, look, we've got all these items um, as part of this doll's house. There's just like loads and loads of items, all cute items just full of cute items and as you can see it is 100% cute and it contains 97 blocks it's, it's pretty it's a pretty chocker item pretty chocker item in fact what we could do actually is we've got a little bit of space look we've got this puppet here which is one of those exclusives that go oh dear oh it's glitching like crazy do you see do you see it's glitching like crazy it can be like a just a little toy that sits next to the <laughs> to the doll's house like that uh, a little toy uh, we might even have room for even this little exclusive penguin that's another exclusives and um, when we've gone through all the star level um, uh, when we've gone through all the star level for towny sims I'm going to be making a video on how you too can get all the exclusive essences because even though the online version isn't available anymore and you can't visit each other's gardens to collect all the exclusive essences there is still a way that you can do it and i will be telling you how uh, later on in the series but for now the doll's house is done let's take it to our cute sims and see what they think of it here we are then hello pinky you're looking mighty sad there how are you it's all okay we're back now Oh my god, she's raging about oh blah blah it's horrible. I'll need a bed. Can you get one for me? No. No, I'm not I'm not Oh bless you. I've got something else which I'm fairly sure you're going to enjoy. So in our inventory here then, here it is. Oh a doll's house. Oh my god, there it is. The doll's house in all of its glory. Um, so anyway, we can do lots of other things in this house, can't we? Let's see what decoratives that she has for us to play with. So we have the apple blossom vase. Have we seen this? Oh, that's that one there. I really like that. I'd love to have that in my house, but hey-ho. Uh, so we have the blue jack-in-the-box. That's something we've seen before. Um, mm. Indeed it is. She doesn't seem that bothered about it. It's a fun item. We have the curtained windows. We have quite a few of those cooking around. Bless you. And we have the freezer bunnies. They're here. The 
the goldfish bowl. Bless you, she has as well. Bless you, Pinky. Uh, we also have look these little kitties. Well, she surely they're cute, right? They're cute. They're... Oh yeah, 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 yeah. She likes those. I like those too. Let's get rid of that Jack in the Box. Don't, don't be upset. You weren't that bothered about it. Um. So, oh, the Kayoshi doll. Is that how's that? That's pronounced. Oh God. Bless you. Oh, it's like a little dinosaur. Bless you. It'll go really nice. Will you stop sneezing? With the doll's house, don't it? It'll go really nice with the doll's house. Look, they're being invaded by some sort of dinosaur. Um, what else have we got here? We've got the oven mitt again. Are you into Tasty? I can't remember. No? Okay, fair enough. Uh, she's not. Uh, what is this? A spray bottle? Um, I, you can't be bothered about the spray bottle. Are you bothered about the spray bottle? Bless you. Oh, she does. The spray bottle is actually cute. I didn't know that. The sunflower painting. Yes, she likes that. It's like, I like that too. That's quite nice, isn't it? Um, the wall butterfly she has over here. They're quite pretty. And she also has the wall cherubs. They're here. Look. And she has that wall fan. I really like that wall fan with the fish on it. Bless you. Um, she also has the water pitcher. So that's already all in place. Lovely jobs. Now we could also paint this little bit. Um, let's get some more pink uh, essences. Bless you. She really likes blue, doesn't she? So we've got some blue puppies here. Um, oh, look. Look, they're happy, of which we have loads of them. <laughs> we'll do the trick. So let's give her blue skirting boards. Oops, a daisy. We've, we've messed that up. Uh, blue skirting boards all the way around. Should we give her blue carpets? Yeah, oh my god. Another blue carpet? She's just in love with it. She just, she loves, she's loving every minute of this deck. deck. Should we just make everything, everything blue? There we go. <laughs> everything blue. Actually, that's, um, that's, wow, that's a bit, cool. oh, it does rise, isn't it? Oh, bless you. Yes, yeah. Bless you. There we go. Oh my god, it's going out of here. Oh my god, Pinky's going to uh, sneeze her nose off at this rate. We'll give herself a nosebleed, one or the other. Right. Did we best friend her? We did. Wow, you're so awesome. Here's a blueprint. I love blueprints because they're blue. Yay. <laughs> oh my goodness, we did it. Pinky is giving you a new bathtub blueprint. Better paint it blue. <gasps> Look, oh, I just cancelled. Oh, no, it, we did it. We did it. We celebrated a bit. Oh, I have a tendency to do that. So here it is. Here's the uh, the new bath blueprint. Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. How, how are we feeling about this? I'm not going to bother making it in uh, for us to look at in a bit. Um, I think we'll just look at it now. Because, look, it's right here. It's right here. Should we try it? Let's hop in. Oh, my God. Oh, there was a glitch there. There was a glitch. Never mind the glitch. There we go. Oh, my God. Oh, that's so nice. It's got a little heart on it there. So it's like a four poster, four poster thing. Uh, should we find out what it's called? Um, so, bathtub. Uh, well, it could be this one. I think it's this one here. Ah. Ah. Palantine. Lovely. I guess that's the style then, isn't it? That's the style. Right then, so next job is that we need to head off to Jeremy's house and give him a doll's house of his very own. So here we are, back at Jeremy's. Is he asleep? No, he's, not. he's out. What? How rare. Jeremy, what the hell? I mean, what's going on? This is, I don't, you're out of your tree. <laughs> um we want to give you things we have for you bless you oh no is it something that just happens with cute sims maybe your very own doll's house <laughs> is that just like lost control of his of himself so um let's paint his now because um his actually seems to be painted uh, fairly well um let's do we have any like oranges yeah we do because he's wearing like an orange let's Oh, we don't really have orange, but this, this is close enough, right? This is similar to his onesie. He does seem to like it. There we go. So we've painted his his place up, and the rest of it's already cute. So, oh no, look, hang on, this floor here. Boom! There's a bit of extra um, happiness from Jeremy. So let's check out his decoratives. Now, I'm assuming they're going to be pretty similar. Oh, look at this, we've got all sorts. Bunny cookie jar, because he's tasty as well, I guess. Oh my god, yes, he likes it. He likes it. That, that's that's a win. He also has the curtained windows. Oh, a dump truck. He has a dump truck. That's a, that's a nice toy. That could be visiting the doll's house. Yeah, he hates it. Okay, it's fun. Let's get rid of that. He liked me taking it away. Uh, we have a teddy bear. What was it called, though? I put it down. Uh, dark brown teddy bear. Fair enough. Oh, this is the green samurai moose. Bless you, Jeremy. Um, the harp. Ah, uh, we've been seeing 
the harps uh, cropping up now. Meh. A uh, light brown teddy bear. We'll put that next to the dark one. Yes, we also have um, a salon screen. Yeah. Towel racks. Bless you. We have his war moon. But he has that in here. And that's it. That's all of his decoratives. He doesn't have many decoratives at all, does he? Poor Jeremy. Well, I suppose he doesn't need them. He's always asleep. He can't be looking at them. Is this enough to best friend Jeremy? Let's find out. <gasps> Indeed it is. Oh, Blala, you've been leaving gifts for me. What a great friend you are. Hey, let's go out and sell a little... <sighs> Fine. Whatever. Jeremy has given you a new bed blueprint. Um, fantastic. Yeah. So here we are. We're celebrating. Um, there is the doll's house. Let's have a look at it sort of in-game. Oh. Once placed in a house. Look, isn't it awesome? I'm so pleased with that. Let me know what you think about the doll's house uh, down in the comments below. Um, see if you can build a doll's house. It, you know, if you do um, or are playing My Sims and you are building creations in My Sims, whether you're um, copying my creations or making creations of your own, why not try and send me a picture? I'd love to see them. And if we get some right, really cool creations, I can always showcase them on an episode, couldn't I? How awesome would that be? We can get all your creations on here too. Oh, that would be excellent. That'd be absolutely excellent. Now that we can't, you know, go to the garden and actually see each other's creations. But whatever. Um, we can we can do it other ways. We have the interwebs and we can send each other pictures and stuff, can't we? Yeah, send me pictures of your creations. Um, and Because I'm on Twitter, you know, you can send me pictures on Twitter. I have a Discord where I hang out all the time. I'm on there every day saying hello to everybody. And we play games on there. We play games together online. About once every fortnight we get together on a Friday and we all play games together. That's a really great place to come and hang out. Uh, talk to me and also... Um, you know, send me pictures of your My Sims creations. Oh my goodness. Uh, if you need uh, an invite to my Discord, by the way, there will be one in the description below. There's links to my Facebook down there. There's links to uh, my Steam group. I have a Steam group. I have a Reddit page. All these places you can send me pictures. Well, probably not the, the Steam group. You probably can't really send me picture, <laughs> pictures through there. But all the same, all the links are in the description below. Uh, find me anywhere you like. And, uh, and send me the pictures of your creations and, and if I collect uh, uh, a bunch of them I shall, uh, I'll make an episode where we showcase all of your creations and if I really like it I may even make some of my own oh my god, uh, as in like make your creations in, in game, you know oh my god, and give them to some of my sims when I come to do a perfect town, imagine your creation being immortalised forever uh, in one of my sims houses, that, 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 <laughs> that would be awesome, I'd really like that, that'd be great and it also saves me from having to come up with loads of new ideas of what the hell to build <laughs> help me peeps help me make things and share them um well we didn't do the carpet in his bedroom when we painted uh no matter um we still managed to best friend him so again i won't make this blueprint we'll just um we'll just look at it here because it's it's just a crib right look it's called bed cradle there we are so there it is that's what it's called uh i can't get it in it because he's sleeping i like that like, look at the feet on it and stuff like that. it's like he heard me uh oh Oh my god, he's like some massive tease. Look at that. I can't. And then we've got uh, the mobile. We've got a little dog and a fish and a star on it. Oh, oh it's, so, it's so lovely. It's so lovely. Oh my god, it's so lovely. Let's head home then and, uh, and call it a day. Yes. Home sweet home. <gasps> oh, it's nice here. I like it at home. That's nice. It's nice. Should we cook something? Should we cook something? Should we cut some to it? Oh, ooh, fish today. Fish today. Indeed it is. Yeah. Yeah. Bit of fish for dinner. Bit of fish. Except when we sit down, it will be... Spag bowl. <laughs> so, uh, we won't look at the blueprints as I say. We've already looked at them in the houses today. Um, two new blueprints. Two mm. new sims that we've best friended. Jeremy and Pinky. They were fabulous. Mm. An awful lot of sneezing today, though. An awful lot of sneezing. Mm. Lots, lots of bless yous uh, going on. That was a bit hectic. Um, and uh, mm. requests for your items so that we can showcase them. That'd be fantastic. Um, am mm. I going to have to build any more mm. items in the future? Mm. Yes, I don't think we have um, a 100% sort of tasty sculpture, right? Something to put into a tasty Sims house. What could we put? What could we build that would be 100% tasty that we could put into their house? Because we're going to have three of those Sims and we're going to be uh, very keen to... to uh, friend them up nice and quickly 
Oh, what could we build? So let me know in the comments below what you think. I should be building um, for Tasty Sims some sort of sculpture that would be 100% tasty that they would really, really like. That fits the thing, you know, of food and, and scrummy umptious <laughs> um, and and yeah and then we can we can build that for the tasty sims I think we also have some spooky sims to go um, uh, crystal and Yuki is it um, and uh, I think uh, that, that they're pretty pretty popular sims uh, so looking forward to seeing them um, but for now Blala it's time for bed isn't it it's been a long one today hasn't it Blala has it's been a long one it's time for bed oh my god let's go to sleep so it's time for naps ah <sighs> Thank you for watching, I hope you've enjoyed the episode, if you did, please hit that like button. As long as you are here, why not check out one of my delectable videos available? Feel free to come stalk me on social media and be sure to share this video with friends so even more may watch my shizwa. See you next time peeps!